No, I love you, Dorian. Okay. I know. I know. Listen, y'all. This is us on a regular basis. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Team to build on that. Don't build nobody up from the the ground up because you're just making them good enough to walk away. To be quite honest. And when <laughs> I say that I'm not a ten, it's not saying that I'm not great because I'm great. It's not saying that I don't look good because I look good and I'm gifted and I'm all those beautiful, wonderful, whimsical things. However, I don't see too many girls who can maintain a conversation. I don't see many girls yeah. who um, is willing to just be their authentic self. I can go slide in the mud and then walk into a ballroom and take the night. So and I can take the me. night. Come on. <laughs> just yeah. me. You just made a song. I don't see too many girls. I don't see too many girls. Yes. <laughs> I don't see too many girls. I don't see too many girls. I don't see too many girls. I don't think so 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 many girls. And I'm not, I don't feel like you should be looking to build anybody up. You should be looking to build with someone. So make sure they got something when they come to the table and continue to build on that. Don't build nobody up from the, the ground up because you're just making them good enough to walk away, to be quite honest. Like, it's all about, it's not about finding somebody to complete you. It's about finding somebody that wants to conquer the world with you. So I need both of y'all to start realizing though, that y'all are 10 because besides y'all both being fine, y'all are 10. Like, y'all are 10. Well, this is this is the thing for me too. The thing for me is is like, I feel like Jerry, you're absolutely correct. We're all tens, and on the other spectrum of that, we all still have so much growing and learning to do. Like, life is a consistent journey, so nobody can meet you and tell you that you're not it. Just like they don't have the right to say that they are over you, because at the end of the day, there's still somewhere that you're that they're lacking that you can help them and there's somewhere that you're lacking that they could probably help you. But everybody is still growing in some area or has some adjusting or some improving to do in some type of area in their life. So nobody's in a position to be over or under anybody at the end of the day. And can I add to that? Because I think huh, when we say 10, I, to me, mm -hmm. that sounds like, in my, it's for me, that's like completion, that's like perfection. That's like an end goal. And when I say that I'm not a 10, it's not saying that I'm not great because I'm great. It's not saying that I don't look good because I look good and I'm gifted and I'm all those beautiful, wonderful, whimsical things. However, there is a process that I'm still on. There's an, and the thing is, I don't know if I ever want to reach 10. Right. I tell you why. Because whenever I stop growing, I stop living. Mm -hmm. Every single day we're learning, we're growing, we're becoming better. And, I, and, and until I die, I want to grow and be better and learn. I don't want to ever reach the place where I have stopped growing. When I stop growing, I'm not trying to be here. Yes. It's, it's time for me to get up out of here when I stop growing. So, so that 10 to me, when people talk about 10, I feel like we're thinking about this, I, for me, that's what I hear, this Imagine you know, image is. of like, I've arrived, I'm there, I'm it, I can't get no good, better looking than this, I can't grow no more than this, baby, well then I don't want to be with you, because that means you're about to be a body, so <laughs> I ain't trying to go nowhere, you know what I'm saying, so that's what I mean, so like right now in my life, like, 
I'm like, I'm there. You know what I'm saying? I'm in my 30s. I'm in the middle of it. You know what I'm saying? So I got somewhere to go. I know I'm good. You know what I'm saying? So just like you said, the, the number system, there's the immaturity to that in the way that a lot of people see it. And so I'm not defined by that number system, right? You know, I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm growing. You know what I'm saying? So when I'm at a 10, we can be at a 10 together at another place. We ain't gonna be, we ain't gonna be two tens on earth. <laughs> so <laughs> it ain't happening. That's what I mean. You know what I'm saying? But I do think that me and me and um Dory, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> I do think that we were uh, we were coming from two different perspectives when we were uh talking about like how we felt our numbers because I do think that he had more of a um a, a different opinion on why he numbered himself, whatever. Right. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'm done. I'm I'm done talking, y'all. I shut up. Wow, <laughs> Until you feel like talking I again. It's okay. in the wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you. Yeah. Um, I guess I guess everybody had their little piece and um you know I guess <laughs> different <laughs> Oh, well, bitch, all day I'm a 10, but it's on a sliding scale whether you're putting in um, personality gifts and, you know, um, I don't know too many girls um, that have their own um, everything. I don't see too many girls who can maintain a conversation. I don't see too many, many girls, girls yeah. who um, is willing to just be their authentic self. And I too can't worry about what nobody else has to say or whatever. Um, Period. You know, I, I, come to the point of being able to love myself I've been able to walk into rooms just as Yuri and not have to worry about oh is my titties sitting up oh do I have my makeup beat for the gods oh do I have my hair ready? I like I can be me I don't have to keep my voice soft and cut all the time you know I can just be me I can go slide in the mud and then walk into a ballroom and take the night so and I can take just the me. night Come on. <laughs> just yeah. me. Just me. Just mm -hmm. you. Just mm -hmm. And I don't need no nigga to complete me. Period. Oh. Period, poo. <laughs> what I said. Period. But I do like to get razzle dazzled in the bedroom at least every other night. <laughs> but that doesn't mean I need a nigga. <laughs> right. Not yet. Come on every other night, okay? <laughs> that was a song, Yuri. Yuri, <laughs> that was a song. You just made a song. I don't see too many girls. I don't see too many girls. Yes. <laughs> Not every other night, though. Girl, we can't do every night like you. I mean, I'd rather have one you get razzle dazzled every a night. Once a week. Three times a day. <laughs> I'm sorry, five. You got me confused with other girls, okay? This is this is this. We don't just say stomping grounds. You think? Remember, you said stomping grounds. Logic. Did he say stomping grounds earlier today? Yeah, from the area we was in. Wait, did he say stomping grounds earlier today? From the area we was in. Right. So we know you get busy. Oh, baby, busy making coins. You know that's all. Right. Right. Your good sister was there. Okay, this conversation is not about y'all. It's not about time. All right. So um, I guess the basic <laughs> discussion is over, and we're going to go ahead and do a recap. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, the basic is hard. No, because anybody who got a scale of a 1 to 10 is basic as fuck, because there's numbers that go beyond that number 10. So if you thought it was so one to ten, you're basic. So, you so I wasn't saying that <laughs> you were basic, but I a hit door will holler. A hit door will holler. But you're the no, I, no, no, I love you, Dorian. Okay, I know. I know. Listen, y'all, this is us on a regular basis. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. Shut up. Okay, so the recap is the homos. Do you want to get serious? Should you only seriously date who? People who classify you as a 10 on a 10-point scale. Why? If they physically see you as a 7, but they see others as an 8 or 9, can that be a cause for concern? Might it still work? How and when? So, everybody, y'all tuning in, please like, comment, subscribe. Tell us what you think. 
anybody you agree with, anybody you disagree with, if you think we should go deeper in conversation about this or whatever, we're here and we want to respond. We want to interact with you all. So do take the time and we will reply. And um, we're going to just go ahead and wrap that up. And to our lovely hosts, they're going to reintroduce themselves and tell you where you can find them on their social media platforms. Um, and I guess we'll go ahead and kick things off with the lovely Phoenix. Yes, yes, yes. My name is Phoenix. You can find me on Instagram at yesthatsphoenix.com. You can find me on Twitter at Phoenix Rocks. I'm on Facebook. I just dropped a new single called Halfway. Please go to YouTube and go check it out. R&B joint. Um, I do a bunch of stuff. Hit me up. I love communicating with artists and people. I love doing talk shows and podcasts. Thank you for having me yet again. Yes, Phoenix. Okay, so Jerry, um, go ahead and give us all of your um, Jerry juice. <laughs> so that's just underscore Jer on everything. Check out the podcast, everything and then some podcast on Apple, Spotify, Google Podcasts, all that shit. Talk your shit Tuesdays. Get into it. One more talk your shit Tuesdays. I like to talk shit. Jill. I like that. I might need to do that because I like to talk shit. But it's your boy Dorian. Was I here to yeah, go ahead, Dorian. <laughs> I'm sorry. This, this, this podcast that got me, you was like, talk that shit. Y'all know I love to talk shit. So, but then, you, have you come Dorian, through then. Um, you can find me on social media, Captain Light Skin, Captain with a K, light as in thin, and skin spelled the regular way. Remember to keep your day lady each and every day you wake up. Stay positive. Know that I love you. God loves you as well. Be breezy. Yeah. Wow, she just gave a sermon. It was one of her platforms. Like this, <laughs> and, but she lot, so I understand because that's my business. Shout out to Tabitha. <laughs> my name is Maven Logically, and you can find me on social media under Maven Logically. On uh, I have my website is mavenlogically.com, and I'm on Facebook, Instagram, all that type of stuff. I used to have a podcast, I don't. I got music. You can probably find that somewhere. I'm not thirsty for it, though, y'all. But y'all can, like, can look it up. Y'all can look me up. Uh, that's it. I really enjoyed myself today. And I meet everybody. Okie doke. Um, and I'm Yuri G. Um, I do not feature Facebook that often. Um, I just get on there to promote stuff and share stuff every blue moon. But if you really want to interact with me, get to know me, do it on IG. It's bossy underscore cannon dot shooter. Cannon camera. There is not there is not a secret message. It is cannon like the camera. Dot shooter. So bossy underscore cannon dot shooter on Instagram. Period. And and I would like to add, I'm executive producing a new show of hers. It's called Yummy with Yuri. And <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be our new. <laughs> <laughs> I, I did some cooking or whatever, and he thinks that I should have a cook show. Um, and I'm here for it. With you. That's sick, right? W yeah. <laughs> that is catchy. You better get it, because you better get it. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I cooked yesterday. It's still some in the refrigerator. You didn't cook today. Ooh, she, she got it. She can cook today. She can cook today. <laughs> Yummy with your episode. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Captain. All right, guys. All right. So, lovely meeting all of you. It was a great conversation. Likewise. <laughs>